Hey, what's up, guys? This is One Shot at Zero Kills, and th and today I'm gonna be doing another different uh, video. So, since Minecraft has updated uh, to 1.3, I'm sure many of you guys are having problems connecting to servers. So, I'm gonna show you uh, what this looks like. So, here, as an example, I have MindZ, and I'm gonna show you what happens when it doesn't work. Right? So, you get connection lost, internal exception, uh, this socket exception saying the connection was reset. Uh, when you get this exception, it means that the server is still running on 1.2.5. So because you have 1.3, you can't actually join the server. You're going to have to wait until they update to 1.3, or you're going to have to you're going to have to downgrade uh, to 1.2.5. Now there are a couple of ways you can do this, uh, but most of them uh, you can find links or there are topics on the Minecraft forums. So I'll I'll leave that in the description below. Uh, but yeah, you know, even if you can pull the server, it should work in a second, give it a minute. See, even if you could pull it, it doesn't mean that you could join uh, because you're going to get that error because you're running 1.3 and the server's on 1.2.5. Now, uh, most servers aren't updated because uh, Bucket hasn't released a, uh, one point, a stable 1.3 version. Uh, they've released... Uh, developmental uh, like versions of it uh, but they haven't released like a final version and uh, because of that most uh, programmers haven't updated their plugins yet so uh, now if I connect to this server it should be fine right so this server is fine this is what normally happens but uh, say connect to this server Logging in, it may take a while. I don't know. My connection's a little slow today. It feels like it, but yeah, uh, this 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 I just got disconnected by server. Uh, this this is because it's full. Uh, you'll see here that I have uh, my auto join uh, mod installed. I've been working on updating it to 1.3, and I'm basically done. However, I'm waiting uh, for Mod Loader and Forge uh, to release their new APIs because if I release this now and you guys install it. When you guys actually go and install Mod Loader and Forge later, it's not going to work correctly and it's going to crash. So uh, I'm not releasing it yet uh, to save you guys the trouble. Uh, but here's just what it looks like, right? So now I've added this auto join properties uh, little button, and you click it, and now you could set the properties uh, for each server. So the ping delay is in seconds. It can go as low as uh, uh, a quarter of a second. Or I believe it can go as high as like, I think it's 60 seconds. Let me go look. Yeah, no, it's 30 seconds. It can go as high as 30 seconds. Uh, but normally you're gonna want it around uh, 1, uh, 0.75, 0.5, or you can go the lowest at 0.25. Uh, I believe it defaults to 0.75 seconds. It defaults to 0.75. Uh, but if you enter something that's invalid, uh, it's just gonna go at the previous. So. But it defaults to 0.75, but I keep it at uh, 0.25 if it's a really like uh, popular server. Now the error delay, it defaults to 4.0. Uh, you're going to want to keep it at 4.0 unless uh, you're getting continuous error messages. Uh, yeah. Now the join offset, I explained this in my other video. Um, I'll explain it again when I actually release it. Uh, but basically, this allows you to join servers like MindZ without having any problems. And now... Uh, there are separate properties for each server. So if I go to MindZ, I could have properties for that uh, for MindZ too and make it different. So that's cool. Uh, but that's all, really all for this video. So if you guys are getting this error right here, uh, socket exception connection reset, this means that the server hasn't updated and you're gonna wanna downgrade uh, Minecraft to 1.2.5 or just wait for them to update. All right, that's it for today. I'll see you guys later.